Hello, people of YouTube, and welcome to episode 3 of my playthrough of the Dire Wolf 1.19 pack. We are in Hexary Town, preparing to make a broomstick so we can fly around the world on our explorations. So far, we've found a dungeon. That was pretty rubbish. And we've got the stuff we need for A2. Check out the last episode if you haven't seen any of that stuff. This time, broomsticks. And more exploration. Um, might be the last episode of exploration. I think I'm going to try and find a permanent home. Yes. There are, apparently, floating villages. So we're going to try and find one of them, and maybe that will become our home. First of all, though, we need to make a broomstick. And to make a broomstick... I don't know why I'm looking in here. To make a broomstick, we need some mandrake root, some wheat, some gold blocks, some willow logs, and a bottle of blood. To make a bottle of blood, we have to jump inside a cauldron with a blood sigil in it. To make a blood sigil, we need redstone and blackstone. So we've got everything apart from the blackstone, which means we have to go to the nether. <clears throat> but we're just looking for blackstone. I think it's easier to find blackstone here than anywhere. We're in a wailing garth. Well, we're not far away from from the other location. Looking at that, um, I think we need to go underground. Scorcher. How about I find some blackstone and then I'll come back. Finally, we've found uh, basalt delta. And this has, I'm assuming that's blackstone. That is blackstone, isn't it? Yes. These have blackstone. Um, nearly 2,000. Do you think that'll be enough? I may have gone a little over the board, overboard, but hey ho Um, right. Let's navigate our way back to, um, the nether portal. You see how far I had to come? Look. Like, miles and miles with portals over here somewhere. Um, Tunnel time. Because I have all of my stuff with me, I can get home very easily. Um, I've got levels. I'm going to plop. In fact, I just thought of this now. So what was the point in going in a tunnel when I could pop something back over here? Uh, back up here, where all the blackstone might be. Yep. Here will do. And, um... Blackstone land. And now, we can go to Hexary Town. Woohoo! Marvellous! Get rid of some of this junk. Um, and... Pop. They're in here somewhere. No, they're not. They are. I'm sure they're in here somewhere. Yes, they are. They're there. Um, and that's in here somewhere as well. Yep, that's there. And then we've got food in here. Jolly good. Right, let's make a broomstick. The blood sigil first. That needs blackstone. And we've got time in a bottle. So why don't we just speed this up a bit? Jolly good. And we, I don't know how much we need. I think we needed four. Um, what else do we need for the blood sigil? Uh, four redstone and some lava. I got some lava in a basic fluid tank <clears throat> from Mechanism. They're very good tanks. So we need a bucket. Um, which we shall collect a bucket of lava. We can put the lava in our mixing thing. So to make these things, uh, they're in a mixing mixing thingy. Um, and we need four of them and four of them and some lava. So we put the lava in. We put the four of them in. We put the four of them in. And it's doing a thing. I think. Is it not? Ah. We need to heat the cauldron. The block below must be heat sources shown. Um... Can we put just a lava block under there, do you think? No. Well, that's annoying. Lava. Oh, we can put some lava under there. We've got lots of lava. 
Um, in fact, we could do something really cool and just let the lava fall. And you're still not doing anything. <laughs> Back in a minute, I'll figure this out, I promise. I'm a derp. I'm a derp. It's polished blackstone, not just normal blackstone. Right, let's give this another go. Okie dokie. Right, so we've got our lava. We've got lava in there. We've got uh, four polished blackstone and four of them. And now you're doing something. Woo! Blood sigil, blood sigil, blood sigil. There's our blood sigil. Jolly good. So now that blood sigil is there. And we can dump the lava. What I was that hit me? Oh, uh, now we need to get a bottle of blood, right? So, bottle of blood acquired by placing a blood sigil inside a mixing cauldron and then jumping inside three times to bleed into the cauldron. Then take a bottle to bottle it up. Okay, here we go. Mmm, and it's got blood in it. Right, we need a bottle, which means we need... I don't think I've got any bottles on me. I did make some. Did I make some? Yes, we do. Haha. -ha. So I now should right click. And we've got a bottle of blood. Jolly good. Alright, bottle of blood. What else did we need? Bottle of blood, two blocks of gold, two willow logs, two hay. So so we've got mandrake root over here. Um oop, take one of them. So we've got the mandrake root. We've got the blood. We need three wheat. What was it? Three wheat. Two wheat. And two gold blocks and some willow. Right, so get some gems. Water in. Nope. Water in. An empty hand probably. And then we will put in two of them, one of them, one of that. Two of them and two of them. Let's make it a broomstick. Oh, I did, didn't mean to do that. Um, um, let's take the broomstick. Dump the blood. Take you out. <laughs> right. Oh, hang on. Let's read the book before I guess. Rather than guessing, let's read the book. That should take me to broomsticks. Broom. There we go. We've made it. Right. How do we ride it? To use the broom, right click on the ground with the broom just like a boat, then to ride it simply right click and to open its GUI crouch and right click. Okay, so right click and then right click like a boat. Ooh, crouch and right click. Right, right click. Ah, that's his GUI. This is the important thing because they do run out of um they do run out of stuff, but right, right click. Space goes up. Ooh, it oh it is like a boat, so we can go up. And sh No, don't press shift. Ah! Oh, I'm okay. Don't press shift, it's control to dismount. Um, how do we go down? Okay, that goes back in my inventory. Um, how do I go down? While riding, to ascend up into the clouds, hold spacebar, and to descend back to the ground, hold left shift. Hold left shift. Okay. Oh, so you hold it. But you press it. Hmm. The key binds if there are conflicting keys or change the descend key to your desire. Okay, so let's go into key binds and change this. Options, controls, key binds, descend, descend. Right. X area descend is going to be. Roll. Do that. Oop. So we can go up. Oop. 
Uh, we can go down. Ooh, there we go. Oh, now this is so much easier. Oh, I've just dismounted again. So we can do that though, and we can do that. And then we can do that. And we can get the pick it up. Right. What I want to make though are some more brushes. So brushes, you have to make a wet broom brush, which is a load of this stuff. And then you dry it on a drying rack. Basically, let me make them. So wet broom brushes need yellow dock leaves, mugwort leaves, mandrake roots, adds wheat, and we've got things here so I can make three brushes so let's get on with that oh and I need to make a drying rack so drying rack drying rack up here right drying rack is just some six of string nothing too complicated I'll come back when I've made them all just made the last one doing very well and we've got a uh, infinite water source here as well now because I kept having to go up and down and now popping that on the dry rack Got three beautiful heads on the dry rack. I wonder. <laughs> Thank you very much. Three spare brush heads. Right, I'm gonna pack up my stuff and then we can go on our travels. I'm gonna leave all the hex airy stuff here. We are going to go to Blackstone land. I'm going to clear out this area a bit around my thingy just so we've got a bit of space down here because I'm going to put pop a nether portal down here because of the 8x8 rule um, 8 times distance so we are now all the way over here and our original portal was all the way down here we're in a good spot we must be miles and miles and miles away at some point I'm going to come back and explore this wither place I'm going to explore this place and I'm going to explore this place but there's no way I'm doing that with my current armor and current weaponry. <laughs> right, let me get another portal built and then we'll go on an exploration. Wish me luck. Better come out in a cave. But it's a cave. It's a cave. Yeah, it's a cave. Oop. What level are we at? Well, uh, level 30, so we're not too far down. Have a look at the map. Uh, we've gone quite a way. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fly down here, and then I'm going to fly up there, and then I'm going to fly down there, and then I'm going to fly up there, and try and build up this map. And then we'll have a look at the map and see what's exciting. Well, I've been flying around for ages and ages, and look, a pirate ship. Arr! Let me land. And we'll talk about what we found, because we found a lot. Oh, oh, don't, oh dear, oh, uh, it's control to go down, isn't it? Yes, it's control to go down. Let me land, and we will look at the map. Oop, very good. Look at this beauty. <clears throat> this has taken quite a long time, I may add. Quite a long time. So we appeared up here somewhere, and I've managed to go all the way down and all the way across and filling in all of this area so we've got a really big area now to explore we have seen uh and i put some waypoints this is one floating sky village there's some more sky villages here there was something that had an awful lot of pillagers in it it might have been this one i can't remember um there's a load of meteors lying around there is also an airship here and another one here more uh things more meteors and then there's the pirate ship that's where we are now more villages and there's another floating village here so lots to explore the first thing we're going to explore though is this pirate ship but before hello moth before we explore it i want to do a couple of things because i know that there are evokers and pillagers on here and the farm I'm going to create, the mob farm I'm going to create, is going to be using Ares Nouveau and their jars. And so I need to capture some things. So a bit of prep work. We've made ourselves a little house. <clears throat> well, I've put some cobblestone up on a door just in case. Um, and a bed. So I've set my spawn. 
So what I'm going to make is this Staff of Ensnarement from Gobbler. I'm actually going to make four of them. And what you can do is you can left click on a mob or an animal and it captures it. And then I can have them eventually when I get my Ars Nouveau set up going. We'll be able to put them in a jar and have some things harvest mob drops from them without having to kill the mob. Very handy. Let's make them. And they take... Um, whoop. And I've got my crafting bench here. They take two emeralds like this. So in fact, let's put them there and them there. There we go. They take a string at the top and they take these gobber rods. And these gobber rods are basically two ingots of gobber, um, which are made with the gobber glob and diamond, iron and gold. And that gives you these rods and there we have four staff of ensnarements that means i can now go and capture a pillager and an evoker because they're going to give me emeralds because i don't have a source of emeralds when we get the farm set up let's go have a look at this pirate ship let's go explore i've emptied my backpack my odds and sods backpack just in case there's loot to be gained oh um there are people appearing already they don't look like pillagers maybe we should fly in rather than boat in what do you think up we go nice and high want to fly in uh have i got a bow let's get the bow out let's see if i can um Shoot these guys from my at the top here. Looks like a lot of skeletons to me. Yes, that's a lot of skeletons. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. trying to shoot me. I think I need my... Da -da -da. Da -da -da. Complete. Okay, we're going underwater. Um... stuff well that wasn't as exciting as I thought it was going to be although it was rather intense having to kill all those skeletons but I've packed up the bit of loot we got was a few bits of armor and a few other bits of bolts nothing amazing so onwards right where do we want to go next i'm thinking all of this space we've got to explore now um this sky island there looks like something here as well uh, it's a forest that's covered in snow i don't know what that is that looks interesting so i think we'll come down here to this sky island and then we'll be able to explore these places as well and that's a pillager outpost by the looks of it Um, a creeper exploded without causing any damage. How strange. 
Right, Sky Island. And here we are at the Sky Village, Bob's Town, I've called it. Um, let's start off right at this end and have a look what we find. Oh, I've just done the thing again. Oh, Droof! Oh. Oh, dear. Um. Okie dokie. And where are you? Are you still coming? There he is, look. Still coming down. <laughs> dear, oh dear. Right. Don't press shift. Press control. Now I can press shift. All right, let's explore. Carrots and wheat and potatoes. Got all of those things. Nice lanterns. Right, what have we got going on in here? Bed, bed, villager, chest. Nothing. Oh. They look quite good. All right. I think what might be good is if I explore this amazing looking place and then bring you back in when something interesting happens. Hello. I've pillaged. I've got quite a lot of books from bookshelves. I've got a few iron things and gold things and diamonds and emeralds, but not much else. Right, onwards to the airship. Look at this thing. An AE2 one, do you think? Or a coal one? But look, it's come down the hill. Look. Isn't that clever? Right, airship. I have no idea what's going to be in here. Oh, I've done it again. No, 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 no. Yes, 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 no. Right. <clears throat> now we can. No, 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 no. <clears throat> oh dear. I'll, I'll, I'll come back when I've got my stuff. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> That was not fun, but hey ho let's go and not press left shift. Well, that's got dispensers in it. Are they going to fire arrows at me? Oh, this is going to be a gold mine, I'm sure. Oh, hello. Let's go up first, and then we'll go down. Got to record uh, going down here, but there's nothing down there, so you didn't miss anything. Right, next! Airship number two, Sky Village number two, and we'll go and loot them, and then we'll figure out what to do after that. I'll only come back if something amazing happens. Not amazing yet, but definitely interesting. Look at this thing. And on the map, look. It's like a skeleton of something M mad. So. Yeah. Stay still. 
Hmm. Thank you very much for your leather and your leads. Right, where was I? Oh yes, let's go to sleep. As the sun sets over the mysterious skeleton, the de-stressing dad ponders what lies ahead. And I'll tell you what lies ahead. A boat. A boat and an exploration. Yeah, okay, that wasn't very interesting. Right, onwards. Haha. -ha. Hello. I love you. Thank you very much. And here we are in another sky village with an awful lot of quartz stuff. Oh, hello. Um. Can I help you? <laughs> Did you need something? Are you all hanging around the bell? Right, sorry. Um, yeah, uh, hello, yes. Hi. Hi, my name's DSD. Oh, all right then. Oh, they just made a baby. Didn't need to see that. Right, I'm going to plunder this one and see if I can grab some of this quartz to turn into quartz. Back in a mo. Yeah, nothing much in this one either. Few bits and bobs, few things that will keep us going. Um, and I can't turn the quartz pillars and stuff into quartz. You can turn quartz blocks back into quartz, but none of this is made with quartz blocks. It's made with quartz slabs, stairs, uh, pillars, and bricks. And I can't turn that into quartz. I think we need to find a place to call home. There's one more thing I want to do on our adventuring before we set up base, and that's find some bamboo and some cactus. So I'm going to go on a flight and try and find those two things, and then we'll find a place to call home. There's one place I forgot we needed to visit before we find home. Pillager Town. And this way, there's a Vindicator in there, I know, because you can actually see him on the map. Um, He's here somewhere. Vindicator. Zombie villager. Vindicators. So, I'm going to try and capture the Vindicator. I've got rid of one of the animals I caught. And now we're going to go in and face the wrath. Um, I need to set my spawn, actually, because I don't want to end up a million miles away. Let's go battle. quite good foraging look at the amount of arrows in me right now we're going to go and find some cactus some bamboo and then find a home okay right back soon oh my word i have had to go on such a long journey oh zooming out the nearest well the first bamboo i found was up here Right, all the way up here, miles away. I was kind of decided, I was here, I decided to just go straight north. And I thought, no, 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 that won't work, so I'll go left. And I thought, no, let, let me wiggle and waggle. And then I thought, let me go diagonally. And then I went straight up, and then I found the bamboo. Which was, which was absolutely wonderful. Um, and then I thought, right, from here, I'm just going to go eat, uh, west. So I just went west. And then I didn't find anything. I thought, right, let's try diagonal again. And I tried a diagonal. And then I tried a south, and I found a desert. Which is great, because I've got cactus. But right next to this desert is more bamboo. Yeah. So I've got bamboo and a desert next to each other. But we've done the journey. We've got back here. We've got a great big map now to explore. Well, we've done most of the exploring that we're going to do, I think. My home base is going to be in this little island here, which is almost slap bang in the middle of the whole area. This has been a long episode. I'm going to call it a day here. In between episodes, I'm going to flatten this little island out and get a base built. Make sure you subscribe so you catch when the next one comes out and you see the base build. Right. Catch you all soon.